What's up, everybody? This is Jason, Zombie Collected, and I have another TTM for your buttocks. This is Pete Broberg, and I sent to him, I believe, on, like, December 15th. I got it back, I believe, like, the first part of January, so it's about an 18-day turnaround time. So he signed two 1978 cards. One is a team card. Right there, which is very nice. And he signed this in a ballpoint pen at the bottom of the card. So he's not riding across a bunch of people's faces, which was very classy of him here on the Chicago Cubs team card. And then here in brilliantly in blue Sharpie, he signed on this card here again, a Chicago Cubs card here. Now let me do, let me do a little talking about Mr. Broberg. He's 70 years young. His ba major league debut was uh, June 20th, 1971 with the Washington Senators. His last appearance was October 1st, 1978 with the Oakland A's, just a few months before my birthday. Um, his win-loss record was 41 wins, 71 losses. He had an ERA of 4.57, or 4.56, not that great. And his strikeouts were 536. Um, he did play for the Washington Senators slash the Rangers. Then he went on to the Brewers, the Cubs, and finished out his career with the A's. This is a kind of a cool one here. It was, the, was only the fifth player to go straight to the MLB from the draft without spending one day in the minor leagues. Now, that is a cool fact. However... His career, though he had a, a somewhat, you know, decent career as far as lengthwise, you know, maybe wasn't that uh, fantastic if you think about as far as numbers are concerned. So maybe, can you make the argument that if he spent a couple of years being seasoned in the minors, would he have had a better career? I don't know. But only the fifth player ever to go straight from the draft right into MLB. That's pretty cool from uh, 71. So that's a little bit about Pete Broberg, if you know what I'm saying, Mr. Broberg with the Chicago Cubs on this card. I was just wondering out there to kind of end up in this video, is anybody else doing any TTM and who are you sending out for 2021? What's your ideas? What's your thoughts? What are your objectives for 2021? I know a lot of people initially were saying, you know, people aren't going to sign through the mail because of the whole hashtag Rona Everybody's scared to death, but now that it's been a, uh, educating the masses that it can be on surfaces and all that, and it seems to be people signing. You got seventy-year-olds signing through the mail. I've got a lot of TTM successes already. It seems to be doing pretty well. Are you doing the TTM thing? And if so, some of the people you're, like I said, sitting out to maybe you're some projects you're working on. So yeah, if you uh, TTM, let me know what you're thinking and what you're doing at the bottom. And I'm always looking for suggestions, ideas, insights. And until next time, guys, peace.